Good morning, Beaufort High. I'm Michael. And I'm Elizabeth. Today is Thursday, October 31st. And this is your Beaufort High Morning News. Boo! Freshman Student Council is having a bake sale today during the last 30 minutes of fourth block. They will be walking around to classrooms selling goodies. Beaufort High is hosting a trunk or treat event tonight from 5.30 to 7 p.m. The event is free and open to the public. Hope to see you there. Miss Kidd is sponsoring a trip to Greece and Italy during spring break 2020 and is offering you a chance to join the group. There will be an informational meeting on Monday, November 4th at 5.30 p.m. in Miss Kidd's room 3213 for all those interested. Students that borrowed clothing from ISS need to return set items to ISS before Friday, November 1st or you will receive... Congratulations to the two foods and nutrition groups that won the Team Veggie competition last Friday. Teams were assigned a vegetable, including eggplant, kale, zucchini, cauliflower, and Brussels sprouts. They had to cook a recipe and create a presentation featuring their vegetable that maximized the nutritional qualities. A huge shout out to Dr. Boda, Ms. Pitt, Ms. Dunlap, Ms. Frazier, Ms. Grinnell, and Mr. B. Jones for serving as judges. Lots of great dishes by all who participated. Thanks for some great plant-based eating. In a few weeks, the foods and nutrition classes will compete in the famous appetizer contest and the cupcake wars. Congratulations again to the winners. Congratulations to Michael Dennison, Tyson Adkins, and Logan Turner for being selected as the Beaver High winners of the Michelin Design Challenge. The design will be judged against other school winners in the district at the Conquers car show this weekend at Hilton Head. The overall winner will be announced on the main stage this Sunday at 12.15. Members of the Sea Island Reading Cove need to stop by the media center to pick up a pass for the morning meetings. Anyone interested in joining should also see Ms. McKinney for a pass. Blood Club meetings will be held on the first Wednesday of the month at 8 a.m. beginning November 6th. See Ms. McKinney for more information. Youth in Government and Model United Nation Clubs are still collecting shoes for needy families. The last day is Monday, November 4th. They have a set goal of 2,500 pairs of shoes. That is roughly two pairs of gently worn shoes per student and faculty members. Please drop off your gently worn shoes to Mr. Miller's room in 1230. Youth in Government and Model United Nation Clubs are selling Tervis Cups. Money is due when you order. Please see a member to order your Tervis Cup. All money and forms are due to Mr. Miller on Monday, November 4th. Hey Beaufort High, Caroline here with your sports news. Congratulations to Izzy Stone for earning a spot on the All-State Girls Golf Team after she tied for 6th place out of 72 golfers at the state tournament. Izzy shot a 79 and 84 for a two-day total of 163. Way to go! Tryouts for the girls basketball team will begin on Monday at 4 p.m. Athletic packets and physicals must be turned into the athletic office before practicing. That's your sports news. Go Eagles! Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for a moment of silence. Thank you for watching the Beaver High Morning News. Have a spooky day.